We hope that you'll enjoy this episode. Just a reminder to subscribe to our channel and like this video. Alrighty, thank you for joining us for another one of our Let's Play sessions of Valheim. Um, so if you've been following along, you know, we've been messing around, doing some exploring. Um, we've got a little camp over here we're doing with some friends. I've got a, a starter base or a base I'm keeping here at the main area. Um, we have only fought the first boss so far. We know where the second one is, um, you know, way down here. And we will go fight that one um, after our friends get some more armor, because I think it's going to take uh, that and some good weapons. But what I want to do here is I've got this little shack thing that I put together, which is frankly pretty junky. And we are going to rebuild um, a better home. So I'm going to clear out some land here, and, you know, we're going to put in enough, uh, you know, enough room to get everything in, because as you can see, we've just kind of jerry-rigged in our smelting and things like that. We really want a nice, clean setup here. And we'll just let the game dynamics kind of dictate how our house is going to be positioned here. All right, so we're up to two. Right, let's just walk them down. Maybe I'll get more than five in there, actually. I want to keep them in the middle because I think the flooring is going to follow a similar pattern here. Three, like so. Okay. I think that's probably going to be the best way so that I can get to my campfires. They're not necessarily in the way. Um, and I think that's going to work out well. All right. And then jump back over. And I'm finding it is worth the time just to do this correctly. Alrighty, so, you know, I've built up more of the floor here, and I'm trying to make a spot for my um, kilns, because they're pretty large. And I'm going to try to put one here, and I've got I've got some materials I'm going to grab out of the house here, uh, the other one over here. And I'm going to go ahead and put two here, okay? And then I also want enough room for two of the um, smelters this way. I want to leave enough room so I can fit a floorboard under all four sides, if possible. Okay. So these things that have to sit on the ground seem to be the hardest to kind of build your, your stuff around. Oh, you know, I definitely want to leave space on both sides because you can put uh, metal on one side and then you put your other stuff on, on the other. So I think I can put the first one here. And I'm going to go ahead and continue expanding out on the rest. So as you can see, we're one, two, three, four, five, six um, on this here. We'll let that to be in the middle. So I'm going to do the same distance coming the other way. Uh, so I plan to put a crafting table in each corner just to expand, you know, my range here of my little base. Um, and that's just going to help me because I do want to eventually dig a trench and put all walls around it. Um, you know, as the game progresses, I guess you need better defenses, so I'm just kind of planning for that. Alright, so we're continuing to chip away. We've got this corner done, and I'm going to move this uh, crafting table over here to the corner, just so we can kind of keep track of how far our distance is, and I'll probably clean it up a little bit as we continue to move on. Okay, so that is all of our flooring, and just to uh, stay with our little theme here of having one of these in each corner just to expand our crib. Because again, eventually we'll put um, palisade walls around it and dig a ditch and all that good stuff, but we're not there yet. Okay, so we've got the flooring. Now it's gonna be putting in the walls. All right, so um, with the wood that we had collected, we've added some um, kind of framing to start anyway. And uh, we'll obviously need to add more into this, but uh, the other piece that we can do is start adding some walls, so I'll do that with some of the extra wood. So continuing our framing, we've got uh, the first lower part anyway of one wall. Went ahead and left a window there in the middle just so I can kind of see what's going on out there. And I built this little temporary ladder just so we can get up here and continue our framing. So making some more progress, we've got a little bit of a second wall here going. And uh, we still need a bunch more core wood for framing things out and obviously a lot of roofing and things like that. So we still got a ways to go, but we're making progress. Alrighty, so as you can see, we are trying to get some roof started here. I'm gonna put some support pillars up. I think I'm gonna need to do them three in, okay? And then um, I'll probably have a few around this fire as well, just more 
for providing support once we get the upper uh, floor going, getting our support beams up. So we're going to continue this um, roof over. And then uh, we'll obviously need to do the same thing on the other side. So we're just working through that. So I'll show you as I get more progress here. Need more wood. Lots and lots more wood, I see. Uh, but uh, I think it's starting to come together. Okay, to show you some progress here. So we're making more um, leeway. I did need to put those cross beams on for support, so that was definitely needed. But I think we'll have you know another longer piece coming up, and then we'll do our ridge piece. So we're getting closer. We still got lots of wood to collect and build, but the house is starting to come together here. I will go ahead and tear down the rest of my place and move my boxes and all that stuff over now. Here we go. Take these down. And I can collect all of my stuff. This will be my general storage area. I'm going to start here in the corner. And I'm going to work my way over. Try to keep them as even as possible. Alright, just to kind of show you what I'm thinking here. Uh, we will have you know, that little ridge cap there, and then it's going to come up. And then I'm going to leave that space there for, um, for smoke to escape. And then I think this is the center, if I'm kind of playing it right here. And then this will go right on top of the ridge cap. Like that. Continuing our build here. Uh, working on another gangway here, just so I can get to the section of the roof I need to. We're down to our last few sections here. And I'm just going to take just a little bit more wood to finish it off. And then we will have the entirety of our roof done. Putting on our last piece of roofing thatch. Boom. Alright. So all of that is now done. We need to... Um, so yay, roof on, right? No more uh, everything rotting because it rains. But we also need to patch up, you know, these uh, corners. And the other piece that I'm noticing is that this uh, piece up here is a little bit too much um, space. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to put a little little wall there. I'll show you what I mean. Just like so. So there's still room for that smoke to get out, but not as much of a gap in my roof. Alright, I finished one side here. Left a lot of windows here at the top, thinking that if I got a buildup of smoke, it can go out the windows open. Um, but I just think that it's not going to hurt anything. It doesn't look like the rain's getting in, which is really nice. It's raining outside right now, and we're dry, and everything else seems to be dry, and that is awesome because now we're not having to repair things every five minutes. So I'm going to continue to get this uh, this side blocked in. And then I'm going to take out this extra little layer, because our level, because I wasn't really needing it. And uh, and then we're going to call this thing built. And before it gets too dark, I'm going to want to run outside just to show you what we have accomplished. So we've got our shooting platform. We've got room for our smoke to get out. And while it's still light enough, we will go take our last look at our completed house. So plenty of room to shoot things that are sitting on that hill, birds probably, um, and as we kind of look around we've got some windows, plenty of support, doesn't look like any of our stuff is, uh, you know, rotted, so that's good, our roof is doing its job, you know, we'll do some decorative stuff to this over time, but we got the key stuff here, oh, it looks like I had somebody attacking me earlier, so I was trying to get in, but you'll see that it's uh, all nice and built, and we've got you know, some more torches and stuff to put down, but overall, we can now light all our fires, I think. It's nice and bright in here, and uh, we can cook a lot of fish, and the smoke's getting out. And we've got a lot of room to expand and add new things as we unlock stuff, so I'm pretty happy with this, um, you know, little starter home here. So, anyway, uh, lots of work. Appreciate you hanging out with me, and check us out next time for another one of our Let's Play sessions.